Alright. I believe I should be live now. Let me pull it up on my phone real quick and double check. To my channel. And yes, I am. Okay, I am live. <clears throat> I need... I need an audio check, and I don't believe I have anybody in chat yet. Shut up, phone. Don't you dee diddly dee ding at me. Okay, see if I can't get somebody in here. Time to just spam the link to everybody on my Discord friends list. Well, not everybody, but anybody who may have an interest in watching, so. <coughs> okay. While I wait for people to join, I'm going to go ahead and start pulling in... Let's see, how... How do I do that again? Here we go. I'm going to start pulling in some reference images. This one... This is the lady we are going to be modeling. I'm gonna put that right there. Can I select multiple? Apparently not. And then these are gonna be for later. Put that there. And... Oh, grabbed the wrong thing. Put this here. Yeah, okay. All right, uh, is there a way, I wonder, what is this? Okay, this is my layer thing. Is there a way to, like, completely... Wait, so if I do this and then hit... No? How do I... Ten case of wary Midori you Sagi. I hello. Hello. Trying to figure out if there's a way to like quickly recenter this, but see, center the sculpt bounds for the selected layer. I don't understand what that means because if I move this and then click that, then it doesn't do anything. It doesn't recenter it, which might throw me off. Maybe I don't really know. It was kind of doing it the other day, but uh. Mm -hmm. You know what I can do though. How do Jason I do that? Jason Roy, greetings. Hello. Oh wait, what? Hold on. What? What? I didn't know you. I could make. What? Hold on. What? No, I could do that. That's cool. Ten case of wary Midori you Sagi. LOL. The same gun in Prey XD. Oh, I can change the strength of the light it emits. Oh, that's cool. Okay. 
could use that to make like magic effects and stuff, and then I can use this, the metal one, to make like. Here, can I hold on? How can I? Let's see. Whoa. Wait. Ooh, what? Wait. I don't understand what that's doing. Okay. Now, now I kind of understand, but like... That doesn't look good if you actually try to, like, draw with it. That's literally just... For, like, putting a single piece. So how to... Stamp? What well, happened? What did I do? Um, I... Do not know what I just did. The thing froze up for a second, that's all that I know. It's not doing anything now. Why is it not doing anything? Okay, um... <laughs> I'm still trying to figure this out, so bear with me. Let's just switch back to the normal... Yeah, okay, it's not... It's not working, and I do not know why. Um, okay. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We are going to just do this. I, I broke something, I do not know what. Why am I hearing fuzz noise? What's happening? Oh, what the fuck? God dang it. Okay, so it crashed, I guess. Which also apparently has broken my audio. Uh, you get to see my uh, background there. My audio is fucked up. Hold on. Okay. That should have fixed the audio, I believe. I need to... Relaunch medium. Henkesa Wari Midori Usagi. Oh dang, my internet got cut again. Okay, everything's back to where it should be. I don't know how I managed to crash that, but, uh... Oh, there's tutorials? Um... <laughs> Maybe I should watch those. <laughs> okay, my sculpting's working again. to bring these images back in again. 
I'll just do this one for now. Because this is the only one I really need at the moment. Make it bigger. There we go. And then I need to add... There's so much stuff on here. Is it a human skeleton? No. I'll do this. This. Where is it? There it is. Put this directly in the center here. And if I move this, yes, okay, it moves the mirror plane also. Is it, there's no way for me to, like, reposition this thing, though. Okay. Can I? No? Copy to clay? Wait, did that... Hold on then, did I just... Whoa, what the frickin' heck? That didn't work like I think it meant that it was supposed to. <laughs> oh, you know what, I see what the problem is. The scale is too small. Okay, so... You position you there, move this here, and then I need to make this bigger. Probably on a scale about like that, and then reposition it in the center. There. Okay. Now I can shrink my whole workspace down and do a bigger resolution sculpt. Alright. So let's start by just giving it some basic skin to go with the model, I guess. I'm sure there's better ways to do this, but I don't know them. One thing that I can do is I can change this to a different shape. Do it sort of like a paint roller. Henkesa wary Midori Yusagi. I am laughing at this XD. What? Don't laugh! I'm doing my best. No, if you're laughing, that's fine. I'm not worried about it. I'm glad that I can entertain you. 
while I paint a human into existence. This stuff, this clay stuff in, in the hiss, the, like, <laughs> the way that the sprayer sounds and the way this looks, I swear I feel like I'm making a model out of uh, whipped cream. Tenkesu wari midori yu sajai, nah not you, just the way this all this is xd. Tenkesu wari midori yu sajai, like, you are doing it with such focus, and the sound is just funny. <laughs> yeah, it's, I don't know what's up with the sound, it sounds so weird. Like, <laughs> it's so goopy sounding kind of slurpy it's weird like it sounds <laughs> it sounds like if you have like a um like a can of whipped cream that's almost empty would probably sound about the same Tenkesu wari midori yu sajai, and the TOC sound there. TOC? Huh? Tenkesu wari midori yu sajai, yet it is. Need extra on here because it keeps making it go away. Oh. Let me thicken this up a little bit. Hankesa wari midori yu sajai, TOC, like puck puck sound. Hankesa wari midori yu sajai, moves, TOC, moves, spray, moves, TOC. T-O-C, T-O-C. <laughs> talk, 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 talk. <laughs> you mean that? <laughs> what if this is how God makes humans and he just sits and here and plays word, around with you, things? T-O-C? Fact this text to spec. <laughs> Spec. <laughs> Text to spec. Heng case wari midori yu sajai. Yeah. Look at that beautiful face. There, much better. <laughs> Pillow face. The neck's a little bit too thick. It kind of looks like it's got like... 
a neck brace on or something. Let me see if I can slim that down a little bit. Henkesa wari Midori Yusachi, God, now to make more humans to my earth thingy. Starts to spray lots of cream on mud models, <laughs> and bumps more in other parts him. What if, sprays in the crotch more noise. <laughs> Yes, that's exactly how it went down. We've uncovered the true secrets of the universe here today. I think, you know what, honestly, I might start over because I think I'm working on a scale that's too small. When I try to edit stuff, it's kind of blocky and it's not really working the way I want it to. In case of wary Midori Yusagi, imagine that on girls, with crotch bumps. In case of wary Midori Yusagi, yet. In case of wary Midori Yusagi, does this app have mirror mode? So you can do both sides? Marshall Dowberly, this is actually really cool. Kind of males me want to try to make something with it even though I suck at art. Well, hey, next time, you, uh, next time you come over and hang out, you can try it. I mean, I'm not very good at it either. You saw what I texted you, though. The pictures that I did yesterday. Or the pictures of the model that I did yesterday, not pictures. I didn't make pictures in this. I think I definitely need to work on a on a larger s resolution scale. Let me see if I can do th this. Uh, where was that option? I saw it earlier. Here we go. This may exceed the amount of memory available. What? Yes. I don't know what resolution that just enhanced it to, but let's see. Okay, it's big enough now that the smallest brush size will actually make edits, so... Alright, I think increasing the resolution helped. I should make it easier for me to do things now.
I just thought about something else too. I'm sitting here screwing with this, and I just realized for making a character, this is not helpful. Because once I've sculpted all this in and shit, I have no real way of like positioning it. Like I can do this, but I don't really think. Yeah, that's not really a viable option for trying to pose something. So like if I do this, then I have no way to pose it or like do anything else with it afterwards. It'll just literally be stuck in this one standing position. You know what I'm going to do? Henkesa wari Midori Yusajai. Oh well, you can do it, Marshall. Okay, I'm just going to start this over. Henkesa wari Midori Yusajai. Oh yeah, you need to add skeleton auric bones to the models. The, this program doesn't support that kind of stuff. Henkesa wari Midori Yusajai. It means inverted kinetic. At least I don't think it supports that kind of stuff. It doesn't look like it. I don't know what this transform layer is. It doesn't seem to do much, at least on its own. Get rid of those. Alright, we will try to just model this person. Need to move the picture. Put the picture over, like, there, but make it bigger. Okay. All right, let's see if we can just model a person freehand. Start with this too. Let's. How do I? Here we go. That's not. Henkesa wari Midori Yusajai. Something that really helps. Start with a cube or with a sphere. Then case a wary Midori you Sagi, then base it from the object. Okay, I'm gonna start with a floor. And then add a new sculpt layer to do the character on. Wait, which layer am I working wary, on? Midori, you, Sajai, lols. Uh, okay, this is layer two. The new one is layer three. All right. Switch back to this. Let's start with the main body. This is probably not going to be a very like good-looking model. Here, you know what? We will do it at this size. This is the torso. Oh, crud, I still have the... kind of surface. Oh, that's cool! So then I could do, like... Okay. Okay, so that's an interesting feature. I can actually probably use that for something later. What did I miss? You haven't missed much yet. I'm just screwing around with stuff right now. Okay. Got a floor. Actually, let me... Can I, like... I need to have this other layer too, but can I? In case of wary Midori you Sagi, he played God. In case of wary Midori you Sagi, 
XD. Okay. Let's see, what's the best way to start a character? Let's see. Okay, that's that's small polygons there, so I want to do it probably at about a scale like this. Alright. So let's... Okay, you know what, you know what I'll do? I will start by making the waist let's see oh you know what hold on for doing the waist let me put this on a plane that way the waist will in be in case of wary medoi use agi use shapes to make the body That looks about like the shape, like the general shape of a waist, right? Turn this off and add. Oh. Hmm. Oh shit, I'm doing that on the wrong layer. I need to be doing that on this layer. I would like to be able to make this level with this other thing here, but... Oval shape. In case of wearing the Dory Usagi, watch as carefully as that. The waist of an ant. Hang case of wearing the Dory Usagi, JK. I've seen things where people have done this, but I can't really figure out how. There's like a way to do it flat. How do I do it? Case of wary Midori Usagi, displeased grunts. Hmm. Wait. Joints. Oh. Huh, that's weird. Bones. Never mind, that's not as helpful as I thought it would be. <laughs> Elsewhere. Human anatomy. Ah, hey, here we go. Check this out. I can just, like... Hey, perfect. I can cheat. Cheat mode activated. Uh, first, turn that back off. And then also, how do I... There we go. I'll turn this around. There we go. Now we have a body. Hang case of wary Midori Usagi. Now you have God Mode cheat activated. Yes. All the cheats will be mine. Uh, what direction is this facing? Ask Oko of Yunin, can you 3D print out the things you create in this? Uh, if you export them, yes. Hang case of wary Midori Usagi. Your save files will not save due cheats are active. I need... is there a way... Whoa! Okay, game. Stop glitching. Uh, you... can I move you? Yes, I can. Move you down. There you go. Okay. 
Ears. <laughs> That's weird. This is harder than I actually thought it was going to be because I have no idea how to sculpt a human being. What is this? Oh, that's the ear. Feet, heads, bodies, hands. These things don't really help me as much as I thought they would because they fit together weird. Primitives. Maybe primitives will work better for me. Let's start with this. Let's do primitive shapes to start. Move the floor down further. Right. That's the top of the body. That's a little bit lopsided, but whatever. That'll be the waist. This is the worst looking human being ever. <laughs> Here, you know what? There, human being, done. <laughs> greatest, greatest creation ever. I'm I'm not very good at this. I am very very horrible at this. Honestly, I don't even know what I'm doing now. I'm just like messing with shit. Henkesa wearing Midori Usagi reminds me of Super Meat Boy character Tofu Boy. Tofu Boy. <laughs> Is he a villain? And Super Meat Boy, since he's made of tofu. He looks creepy. He needs something. doesn't work. Henkesa wary Midori Usagi, nope. Just a pun character do Pita or Vegin saying that the game is bad just because has meat on it. I got off topic already <laughs> from what I'm supposed to be sculpting. 
and instead I'm doing whatever the hell this thing is. Goodbye, little tofu boy. I do not know how to sculpt a human being. That looks kind of vaguely, sort of slightly humanoid. I was trying to see if there was any way to make it do the uh, tutorial videos, because I have no fucking clue what I'm doing here. I don't really know how to get it started is part of the problem. Like, I don't know how to start a human figure.
I think I should start with just doing the torso first and worry about the limbs later. So let's see if we can get the shape of a torso here. I can't really tell if I'm making progress on making this look better or not. I think as I whittle it down, I am getting sort of closer to a, a vaguely human torso shape. Lopsided in a bunch of places though. In case of wearing Midori Usagi, somewhat better, yes. Okay, well, it looks like shit still. But, oh. Okay, well, apparently I can't. Wait, am I. In case of wearing Midori Usagi, oh. TBH, better use Blender if you want to make it good. Heng Kesa Wari Midori Usagi, XD. Okay, I'll just get rid of this. I don't need this floor. Windows running low on memory, I don't give a shit.
this starting to sort of look like a person. Small changes here and there, adding up. I'm sure there's probably so many better ways to have done this. So the front... Starting to sort of look like a person here. From the side though, it still looks like... Blech. That was a pretty quick butt. <laughs> I accidentally did that in a very efficient way. So, on a scale of 1 to 10, how human shape is this? I don't like the way this tapers. It's hard to control. Might be a little bit too much there. Take some of that off. Especially here in the back. Too big.
I think I'm starting to get somewhere with this. I don't know if it's where I intended to end up, but I think I'm getting somewhere. Need more mass for the arms. Too much mass. There we go. Let's see, this is where the wrist should be. I want to make this slim. That looks very lopsided and horrible. Shut up, go away, I don't care. I know Windows is getting low on memory. You keep saying that. In case of wary Midori Usagi, that could make your PC to die though. That's fine. In case of wary Midori Usagi, for a moment, there, there was a dong there. There was a what? Oh. <laughs> you saw nothing! In case of wary Midori Usagi, brew.
I'm not very good at this. <laughs> Perfect hand. <laughs> Completely in proportion and not at all misshapen. And anyone who says otherwise is blind. It also doesn't look like it's backwards. <laughs> this is the palm of the hand. Definitely on the right side of where it's supposed to be. I do not know what I'm doing. Maybe I should have started with something more simple than a character sketch. Um... Mm. You know what? Let's do that. Let's start with something different. Give me an idea. Something simple. Henkesa Wari Midori Yusajai is an artistic decision. Give, give me something simple to try. So I want to work on a scale probably about... Right here. Hen case of wary Midori you sagi. I could suck us to hand. Feel you with this hard XD. Alright. Hen case of wary Midori you sagi. Try to make a face, or a head, or a fish.
This is the weirdest shaped hand ever. Ten case wary Midori you Sajai, yep. Now sell it for thousand of dollars. My controller is going dead. Oh my god, I need a new battery. Yes, 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 I know, I know. Critical error, touch battery controller low, blah, blah, blah. Shut up, I'm working on it. <clears throat> Do I still even have any batteries left? Okay, yeah, I have a whole pack. When you have technology that's so advanced that you can literally be inside of a video game and the controllers run on double A's. <laughs> In case of wary Midori you Sajai, still AAS? Dang it, we are living in the future with tech of the past. I have no idea what I'm doing in this stupid app. Check it out, I gave him a dice. <laughs>
Heng Kesa Wari Midori Yusajai, LOL. E.T. loves to gamble. <laughs> this is not what I was supposed to be doing. And now it's a block of Swiss cheese. In case of wary Midori Yusajai, practice, practice. I need, I'm, I'm gonna have to find like some tutorials and stuff to follow for this to learn how to actually do stuff. Cause right now I'm just adding and erasing and smoothing randomly. I feel like I did better yesterday. I wonder.
Whoa, check this thing out. Okay, how do I turn on? How do I turn on the mirror mode? I do not know how to turn on mirror. Okay, I think doing a full character may be a hopeless uh, endeavor for me at the at this point in time because I have no fucking clue what I'm doing here.
Yeah, the resolution was too small. I was trying to figure out how to bring some detail back to the eye, but it just looks weird now. One giant eyeball. There we go. Yeah, whenever I do that, like, you can see how low the resolution is on the polygon count for this model. This is super weird looking right now. I think I'm done actually. I'm not gonna get anywhere with this. I need to practice more in private. But I hope you guys in enjoyed to some extent the weird garbage bullshit that was this stream. Um, I'm gonna go look up tutorials and stuff about how to actually use this program effectively. And then maybe I'll try this again later. first for whatever reason just because it's the random color that I decided on you make there we go yellow we're gonna spray paint this guy yellow There we go. It's a crash test dummy. Honestly, at this point, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. There. He's the caution skeleton.
Remain cautious. It's the caution skeleton. If you're not careful, he'll come and get you. Because he's got spikes, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. It looks like he's been stabbed, though, with the way I'm doing that. Check it out, I made a new horror game character. Caution Man. He impales you if you're not careful. Okay, I actually am done now. Goodbye to all of that. And goodbye to you guys. I will see you later. Maybe I will be able to, like, figure out how to do some stuff in this. Maybe. Maybe I'll learn to do some better stuff in this, but, uh, but, uh, dang, stop it, stop it.
Yep, there we go. So maybe I'll learn, but I think this message says a lot right here. Don't count on it. That looks kind of funky. <laughs> Of all the models and like stuff that I've fucked around with here, if I had, if I was gonna get anything like 3D printed, it would be this, just so I could like give it to somebody else. It's like, hey, go do this thing or something, and I just hand them this. It's like, don't count on it. Alright, well, I'm done. I'm pretty sure you guys didn't, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. If you didn't, yell at me in the comments and tell me that I suck and that I shouldn't do this anymore. I'm gonna go and watch some tutorials now. So, <laughs> you guys take it easy. Bye-bye.